Jennifer Hyde, and I'm here today to talk about how to remove locking gel from your dreadlocks. So locking gel is not that uncommon. You don't have to use it, but if you are a product user, you want to definitely make sure that you're cleansing the hair thoroughly enough to get that stuff out of there so that it doesn't become a dust magnet for you. So what we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate and show kind of a deep cleanse. Uh, we're going to do so doing a three-step process where we're first going to cleanse the hair with an actual regular shampoo. Then we're going to follow that with a cleanser that is baking soda, warm water, and essential oils like tea tree. And then we're going to follow that with a conditioning process that's also very, very simple with warm water and apple cider vinegar. This is a three-step deep cleanse process that will help you remove locking gel or anything else foreign from the hair.